Hey, it's Randy Burgoyne with Impactization.com. I got an email yesterday that I thought I'd share with you in case you get something similar. It's from Dropbox and it says that uh, no new devices can be linked to your Dropbox account. You're full. I think it's 10 devices or something like that. So um, over time, if you log in with several phones, several different computers, it may come up and say, hey, you can't log in anymore. And they're going, what? I don't know what the problem is. Well, here's what to do. Um, log into your Dropbox account. Just go to dropbox.com. You have to do this on the web version. And um, you'll see your little icon right there. Mine's just kind of this funny looking face right there. And you can click settings. And then connected apps or security. Let's see. What is it? Security. <laughs> here we go. Security. So if you look here closely, and hopefully it's big enough that you can see, it shows uh, the browser versions of Dropbox that I've logged into. Um, my current session is on Chrome on Windows 10. Uh, this morning I was on Chrome on my Mac and when I saw the error message and started uh, fixing it. Now I started deleting these but I thought oh, I'm going to show people how to do this. So here we go. I'm going to expand this out and expand my screen so you can see it a little better. If you notice under devices then uh, there's all these devices and there was some more that I started deleting them and I thought oh, I'm going to wait and uh, record this and show you how to do it. So here it is. Um, right now I've got uh, my phone, my Android phone. About three months ago I logged into Dropbox and probably downloaded some files. But then there's some older computers here that I'm thinking, oh okay, Rand LDT, that was five years ago. That was an old laptop. Hmm. I'll delete that one and link it. CP332, don't know what that is. I uh, might have been visiting somebody and wanted some files, so I logged in to download them. And uh, a few in Draper, same kind of thing. I was out at a client's office, um, logged in on a Linux box. Okay. And another one in St. George. I'm going to just unlink those because those are like four and five years old. Don't think that um, I'm going to be using those computers. So I'm just going to delete those. I'm going to leave my Android. I'm going to leave my Windows and my Mac. And there I'm pretty safe. So now I've freed up those additional licenses or those additional devices that I can use to log into Dropbox and not have any trouble at all. Uh, it is, has happened to me where I've gone to log into a device with my Dropbox and it, it just keeps refusing. And I know I'm using the right password and everything's okay, but it just won't let me in. Well, it's probably because of this. You've actually used too many devices over time. Now, I've, I'm still on the uh, free 15 gigabytes of Dropbox. Remember back, uh, I don't know, 8, 10 years ago when Dropbox started going? It would give you two gigabytes of storage. And if you referred a friend, you would earn some more space. Well, I earned enough space to get uh, 15 gigabytes, which was their maximum at the time. And I still use that for uh, occasion because people still use it. Customers still use it. I still um, like to use Dropbox. Um, I do use OneDrive and Google Drive. Probably Google Drive has most of my files in it. It's just a matter of being in the IT industry and having to use everything and try everything and demonstrate everything. So anyway, there's Dropbox. Um, you can delete devices so that you can free up more devices to log in. And thanks for watching. And whenever you see impactization videos, please be sure to like and share and subscribe.